A fire rescue in Everett, a small child saved from a burning apartment building. WBC's Beth Germano is live near the scene. She's got the breaking details on this. Beth? Well, two DPW workers here in Everett are being given a lot of credit for not hesitating. They were certainly in the right place at the right time when fire broke out on the top floor of that triple decker behind me. And they helped to facilitate the rescue of the little girl. We're coming down Hancock Street. I smelled smoke, smelled something. I asked him, you smell that? That's how these two Everett DPW workers sprang into action, seeing smoke coming from the third floor of this Hancock Street triple decker. We're coming down Hancock Street. I smelled smoke, smelled something. I asked him, you smell that? So come the quick action of Jesse Winnicore and Jason Papa was crucial to the rescue of residents, including a three-year-old girl on the top floor the men knew was inside the unit, but they couldn't reach her. We're coming down Hancock Street. I smelled smoke, smelled something. I asked him, you smell that? So we're coming down to try to go up further to the point that I couldn't, couldn't breathe. My eyes were burning. That's when they met an Everett firefighter heading in as they were coming down and told him where to go to make the rescue. He went up, did his thing, ended up coming out with the little girl. She was unconscious, bring her to the ambulance, revived her. She was, you know, uh, can't even. She was unconscious. Both men emotional about the effort and calling the firefighter no less than a hero. He went up, did his thing, ended up coming out with the little girl. She was unconscious. Now, the girl and the firefighter were both taken to the hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. About 20 people have been displaced in this fire. Those two men tell us they just did what they had to do. And the cause of the fire is under investigation. Reporting live from Everett, I'm Beth Germano, WBZ News.